la di da di da I'm actually going to be able to rob this base for once. What the? Hey guys, it's me, the Russian Hornet. Today is my first video with some tutorials and today I'll be showing you how to make a combination lock. Yeah, that's right, guys. I'm making a combination lock. As you can see, if, like, in my other bit, you go through and you find five levers and there's a three digit code, which, as you can see, is A, B, D. So I click A, B, D, and it opens. If I do A, B, C, D, it closes. If I do A, D, then it closes. If I put all of them down, then it closes. So only the combination of A, B, and D works. So I'm going to try that again. A, B, D. So basically, this is the contraption. Pretty simple to make. But because I'm a nice guy, I'm going to show you how to make it. So guys, for the tutorial you need, you will need 40 blocks of your choice for the wall, 25 blocks of your choice for the redstone bar, you can just do 64, 65 blocks of your choice if you want to do the whole thing at the same, 7 pieces of redstone, 8 redstone torches, 3 redstone repeaters, 5 levers, an iron door, five signs is optional. I'll show you in a minute. I'll show you why later. And 64 blocks of your choice just to use building to get up into places. This unit is survival. Right, guys, so for the first part of the tutorial, I'm going to do a nine long, four tall wall. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And this should leave you with four left if I was doing it in survival. If you have 40 obviously, so you get rid of them. And I'll go back into survival. So what you do now is from two blocks of numbers at time. So two blocks on the left side of the wall, two blocks in, you're going to dig a hole, or mine two in between, so you can put the iron door down, and then you leave a block, and then you put five levers down. This is where the signs come in, you can do A, B, C, Like I said before, that's not compulsory, but if you want to make a little cool animation, like cool bit, so guess the code and find clues around the room that says like EBA, you can know what you do. So yeah, that's part one. So guys, next up, what we're going to do for this combination office, we're going to have to go around the back and see where this door is. If you're looking it through here, on the left hand side, you've got a piece of redstone down, miss the block, put an iron block down. Then use one of your building blocks. This is survival by the way. And then do two blocks. Two blocks, one next to each other. So make like a little stairs. And when it goes one higher than this one, you move it across one. And you do that all the way to the end of the wall. So next off, what you do is for your code, if you want it to be A B E A B D again, you're gonna put a, B, this is to like set the code, and then the other two are going to be like that. Basically what you're going to end up with is like this. So A, B and E, which is you're going to be your code, are on the floor like so, and then the redstone, and then the other two are like this. That's part two. 
next will be the redstone. So now that we've done the setup of the redstone, all we need to do now is run the redstone along this line like so. And now what we do is for the redstone torches, we go one, two, the combination of and three. So that's the combination. And then we've got redstone torches there for non combination. We've got one underneath the combination, which aren't isn't the combination, sorry, in between these iron blocks. And then we've got a redstone repeater down. And then you put your redstone torch there. So then when you press A, B, D, it opens. Press C down, it shuts. If you press E down, C, C up, it shuts. No. If you press E up, and all those be down, it opens. You can kind of hard to clear, cover this up. If you do that, then indeed it doesn't work anymore. Do that. So your best bet is to try and use half slabs cover your iron up like that, and you half slabs there, cover up the building like that. You can't do that either, so you've got to be quite creative on how you're going to cover it up. So anyway guys, that's been the tutorial. If you'd like to see more redstone tutorials, then be sure to check out the Roasted Ornit. And you can remember to subscribe and I'll see you later guys. Bye! Yeah.